Hello and welcome to News Hour on Atlantic TV. I am Summer Lester. On our top stories today, INEC declares Son Wolu winner of 2023 Lagos governorship election. Obi expresses sadness over lives lost during polls. NDLEA seizes 1.2 pills of tramadol in Kogi, Gombe. On entertainment, Adikunle Gold surprises mom with new house on 60th birthday. The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, has declared Governor Babajide Sonwulu of the All Progressive Congress, APC, as Governor elect of the Saturday poll. Sonwulu polled a total of 762,134 votes to defeat his opponent, Labour Party's Gwadiboro's rival, who polled over 300,000 votes, and Dr. Olajide Adediron of the PDP, who polled 62,449 votes. The state returning officer, Mrs. Adenike, returned to who was elected. Meanwhile, the chairman of the Labour Party, Lagos Chapter, Mrs. Dayo Ekong, has urged the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, to cancel outrightly the governorship and House of Assembly elections conducted on March 18th in Lagos over electoral malpractices and irregularities. Ekong described the exercise as a sham. The presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter Obi, has expressed sadness over the loss of lives in acts of violence carried out in the governorship and state house of assembly elections on Saturday. Several incidents of attack and voter suppression were reported across the country, particularly in Lagos State, where the party had established a strong support base ahead of the February 25th presidential election. In a tweet in the early hours of Sunday, Obi prayed for a quick recovery for those injured in the process. The National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, NDLEA, has seized over 1 million pills of opioids in Kogi and Gombe State. The agency said it also disrupted the activities of a drug syndicate that operates between Nigeria, East Africa and Europe. With the arrest of two members of the cartel at the Mutala Mohammed International Airport, Ikeja, Lagos, spokesman of the agency Femi Baba Femi said in a statement yesterday that operatives at the Lagos airport had on March 13 intercepted a member of the drug syndicate, EJZ Vitos Ifani, during a screening of inward passengers on Ethiopian airline flight from Malawi via Addis Ababa, the arrival hall. According to the statement, when a search was conducted on him, it was discovered that one of his two bags had a false button concealment. On entertainment. In celebration of his mom's diamond jubilee, Adikule Gold organized a low-key birthday party for her. At the party, the singer pulled a master stroke when he handed her documents for what would be her new home leaving his mom, family members, and other people present at the celebration speechless. A video of the singer presenting the house document to his mother surfaced, and word of Adikunle Gold's extravagant birthday gift quickly spread online. Other celebrities like Faust and his wife, Simi, were also present at the luxurious party. The singer also performed a live rendition of his new song. That's all we have for you today on News R. For more stories, kindly visit our website, www.atlantictv.org. And do also follow us across all our social media platforms displayed on your screen. Thank you for watching.